so if anyone cares I am back and yeah today we're gonna be doing some speed art and I might be talking about things that I didn't get to do in the past oh, it's, uh, few months and let's just get into it I guess so first I, I actually wanted to make this uh, animation about birthdays which I just you know I didn't have time to do it's uh, I, I actually wanted to you know make it really nice and um, it's just not I don't know I just didn't have fun making it I kind of like sat there and I did something else while doing it and then I just dropped it maybe I'll come back to it who knows but uh, I have in plan uh, to finish it by the end of the year <laughs> so yeah if time suits me I'll do it but let's t let's talk about what we're gonna do here today. Uh, so I've got this video video that I recorded of me doing Drake, and I made him from two pictures. I kind of uh, combined them two because I couldn't find a good enough picture of him now. So I kind of just made his beard bigger and uh, just changed his hair a bit. And yeah, you'll see later on in the video uh, what it turns out like. But I also want to say that I've, uh, I think I found out how to actually draw because before I I didn't actually use the pressure sensitivity. I just kind of went for it with no pressure sensitivity, and I think that was my problem because I couldn't draw straight lines. They were very inaccurate. It works way better, so I don't know. Um, anyone is struggling with their lines, just try that. Try your pressure sensitive. Use it. That's what it's there for. And I, I wasn't using it, and I think that's what was, uh, that's what my mistake was. So. <clears throat> I've got two drawings uh, that I did. I was gonna do four, but that turned out to be a bit long. I was just trying to make this video as short as possible because I don't have much to talk about really. I just kind of have this basically. And as I said, I just have this to talk about. I was trying to make it as short as possible, trying to speed it up, trying to cut out as much as possible, and uh, here I am just doing Drake, and I was meant to do Cardi B, but I just couldn't fit it in. The video would have been 40 minutes long if I did Cardi B. Cardi B alone took me 20 minutes, uh, yeah. On a 60% speed up. So that's a bit like mm, two hours of work, you know, not a big deal. I also cut out my sketching. As you can see, I only did the line drawing here and the coloring in. And I think it turned out pretty good. I can't say that I'm the best right now, but I might get even better. You know, I instead of drawing from from picture, I might soon start drawing from my memory, which is not that good. So that's why I draw draw from the picture. And what else can I talk about? Really, yeah, I've got a few projects that I've been working on on uh, my tech channel, and that was the video about the Sony Xperia XE2 and I you know you can go check it out if you want I think 
I think it's a decent video. I also been doing some animations for DJ Biscuits, my good friend, you know. We've been working, uh, in, you know, we've been working on a few things. He's uh, been doing DJing, mixing, and stuff. And I've just been using it for either my videos or making him videos. And that leads me to my next point, which is go subscribe to him and go follow him. Go follow me, obviously. And it's pretty much all I can say about that. Another thing I wanted to say I've got new animations. I've got a uh, my intro, my outro, which DJ Biscuits also did some mixing for, and I think it turned out pretty good. I mean, you can check it out yourself once you finish watching it and listening to this. I've been trying a few different things, like this, the speed art. I didn't do this, um, and I didn't have plans for doing it really. I got this tablet and I thought, you know, I'm gonna try to do cartoons, I'm gonna try to do animations. Uh, uh, clearly didn't work out because I'm not enjoying them right now. Maybe in the future when I get kind of get the idea of it. But I'm just not enjoying it right now and I think this is much better for me. So, um, YouTube is kind of bitch really and their new new stupid rules yeah so i'm gonna read you out this and um, channels will need 4000 hours of annual viewing time and over 1000 subscribers which means i'm probably never gonna get money it's not like i want to get money but you know i need some <laughs> not not really i want some that's, that's really thing and um, it's not really for the money but I think everyone would want some money and uh, what else can I say really it's, you know it's not it's not bad but uh, you probably already heard it as well it's all Logan Paul they're from PewDiePie, biggest YouTuber on the platform, obviously, but Logan Paul kind of went a step further, and he just doesn't know when to stop. He's been going around chasing dead rats, now he's doing streaming with what was Lil Yachty, I mean, he, he, he can't even play for his life. He wants to play Fortnite, <laughs> I mean, fair play, he wants to get some views, but he just can't. No one's gonna watch it, except for his little army, I guess. No one else is gonna watch it, he's not gonna get views like Ninja, who is actually good at Fortnite. And yeah, Fortnite, that's um, <laughs> my next point. So, does anyone feel that Fortnite is overrated? No? Yeah, neither did I. But um, I think that a lot of people play it. And maybe it's too much. It's like every other game that comes out that's free. But again, the news are onto gamers because. They're saying people are spending too much time. And I see their point because I see my friends playing and they're like a thousand wins overall and they have like ridiculous numbers of like six thousand hours or something. So they are spending a lot of time. I'm not saying they're not. I mean if you guys want me to do some streams on Fortnite, I'll be more than happy to do it. And 
I got a channel. It's called Aku Plays. Pretty bad content right now, but you know I got better in the last few days. So I guess maybe if you guys want me to do it, I'll do it. But we are getting to the end of the Drake and the Drake speed art here. And as you can see I've just did I just did the the little shadows light reflecting at the back of his head and body and it kinda gave him the better look, I guess. The shadows and everything. So overall, I think this is pretty decent for first try of speed art drawing. And now we got Grammy. So he's a Polish DJ who just won himself a ticket to Eurovision 2018. So good luck to him there. I'm really enjoying his music right now. It's actually, it's actually really good. So uh, you should go check it out. I mean, he's got some really good underrated stuff. He's just an underrated DJ, like, overall, but you should definitely go check it out. So, while I'm on the topic of Eurovision, I've got this channel that I just kind of... I, I, I'll put out a video about Eurovision and my thoughts on songs. Um, and I think, even though... Eurovision is highly pol political and biased in a way. I, I think it's good to put out videos like that just to show that there are other people that have a voice than um, the few people that watch it basically each year. And I just wanted to and I give my point, or ra rather give my opinion on the songs. Uh, it's not really doing that bad, but not doing that well. There's a few, quite a few dislikes. Not a lot of people are liking it, I guess. And as you can see here, I've actually been trying out different sensitivities because something was wrong. But, um, as I said before, I actually got this uh, As I said before, I actually changed the still kind of no pressure sensitivity to pressure sensitivity in drawing because now I actually feel like it's working and you can see here I've painted around his glasses like it's just nothing, you know what I mean? And you can see that uh, I, I think it, if I did it just with no pressure sensitivity, it would just be a big blob and I wouldn't get anywhere with it really. So. What I'm trying to say is, you, sh you should try pressure sensitivity if you don't use it, even in cartoons. I mean, I've I've been watching uh, Butch Hartman, uh, he was an ex Nickelodeon animator, and he, I saw him using pressure sensitivity and I was like, but cartoons have this tick, cartoon characters have this tick border. How do you draw so well with it? 
Uh, and you've seen in his videos that he uses pressure sensitivity while drawing cartoons. And that made me want to try it as well. So I gave it a try. And it worked perfectly, as you can see. I don't know why I thought that you have to have this pick line on cartoon characters. But I just did. And I guess... Now I don't. Now you can see I'm adding these shadows to his hat. And that kind of made it st stand out a lot. Really, this gave it a little depth, if you will. And again, Grommy is isn't really a Polish name, is it? It's kind of more like he wants to be international, but he isn't. You know, there there aren't many people in Ireland anyway that know about him. Um, maybe that will change after Eurovision. I hope it will because. I really want him to do well now because I've seen his songs, I've heard them, and they're really good. Like the the um, the entry to Eurovision maybe isn't as good as his other songs, but I think they'll pass because I think it'll pass because it's such an energetic song. It's such a summer song that it will do well because only because it's summer. Only because it will be summer in Portugal, uh, Eurovision, and it will be sunny because it's Portugal. You know what I mean? And a lot of people are thinking, well, this isn't a good song now. This isn't about now, this is about Eurovision, this is about when uh, people will be having fun in the sun <laughs> kind of rhyme there but yeah I think people don't see that and people don't see how much good, good songs he makes and uh, that's not his only song I think that's about every other song every other song and every other artist at Eurovision though because no one really looks at their at their songs, at their other songs, they only look at their entries. I think that's the same when I post my pictures on Instagram or Facebook. Um, people don't write; they don't really like it. They just kind of look at it, and I, I see that they look at it because I see uh, I've got I don't know like over 400 views on some of them and only two likes. I don't know if people are jealous or whatever they are, I don't really care, I just want to put my stuff out there, but it, I think it's the same with that because they wouldn't go into my profile picture and see what else I have, they would just see that picture, they move on, it's the same with the Eurovision songs because they just look at it and they don't really want to know uh, what else the artist has to offer I don't know it's just my I know, opinion on the whole thing but maybe you, you can you can see my point really and again now um, we are getting to the end of this video to the end of this speed art and as you can see, I added this gradient to him because if you look at it, he has this kind of grade, graded shirt. I just couldn't get it perfectly though. I mean, that's, that's pretty accurate. And then I kind of added some orange lines. It is light uh, that he has. Um, I don't know what, it, what it's meant to be, but it's pretty cool looking, so I just added it in, and yeah, that, that'll be pretty much it for this video. If you do like, please like, 
don't 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 dislike I guess if you like it uh, subscribe thanks to DJ Biscuits for all of his mixing that he does for me and it really does help me out because I wouldn't be able to find perfect songs for my clips and that's really about it thanks uh, to everyone that's watching if there is anyone and I'll see you next time